Hello and welcome back to our playthrough of Ultima 4. We're standing here right by Britain and we do have some things we need to find here. We've got the location of the shrine. We don't have the rune and we don't have the stone or information about the stone. We're going to get the stone here, but we need information about the stone um, here. So um, let's go ahead and enter the town just so no bad guys sneak up on us. And let's take a minute and look at our stats. And you can see that uh, I, last episode, you know, I got up to level five. Um, Shamino is still at level three, and he will be until he gets to 400 experience points. And I think that happened last episode. Julia got to level three, and I did that off, off, off episode. I went back to Lord British, and, and he upped her. So now she's got 300 hit points as well. And then Iolo is still at level four, but he only needs, uh, what would that be? 66? No, 56 more experience points. And then he can be level five as well. So we're, we are progressing. You will notice that we are still sans our ponies. They apparently are gone. They apparently are gone forever. I took, I, I did a little trek off camera and I went down to pause because the thought occurred to me is that, well, maybe it returned to the stables. And so I went down there to check, and nope, no horses still. Uh, I could buy more. Uh, I chose not to um, because they're, they're a little unwieldy. And, you know, if they're just going to disappear on me, then what's the point? Then what's the point? Uh, nothing's changed there with any of this stuff. We do have the Rune of Compassion, actually. We don't need the Rune of Compassion. We have it. That's what that C is. It's the only C when we have. Okay. Okay, so we're missing honesty at Moon Glow. We got compassion. We're missing valor at, at Yalom. Right? Yes, we're missing valor. For some reason, I've got that marked as, as us having it on my notes. That would be a mistake. We've got justice uh, from you. Yep, we got sacrifice honor spirituality and we're missing humility the rune for humility from the ruins of magentia so we have a bunch to do in magentia we really do so let's see what we can find here so we basically we need to find out about the stone we've got the mantra i'm pretty sure we got the we got the whole set of mantras right yes we do so we got the mantra we just need um to find out about the stone and maybe the dungeon so uh, let's see what we can find out about that here. And then we're probably going to head and see if we can get... Um, I would actually really love to get back to Magentia. So we'll see how that goes. All right. So continuing to look at our stats here. I don't think there's anything else. Bunch of reagents still. I haven't done anything with this uh, as far as our spells. But we are, I think, fairly well stocked for our most common spells. So, so we're in pretty good shape. I probably need to uh, do another protection and sleep spell soon. Uh, because we used one of those, but uh, I won't worry about that just right now. Okay, so we can be done with that. Let's also take a quick peek at the map. I haven't brought it up in a couple episodes. Just to remind ourselves where we are, we are in the town of Britain there. You can see it's in the north part of Brittany Bay near Lord British's castle. And um, like I say, we want to try to get to Magentia, which actually isn't on this map. You know, the one thing I would kind of like to get is... Um, I'm trying to remember where it was we were supposed to ask about it. Yalom. I think we have some stuff to get at Yalom anyway. We were supposed to ask of a sextant in the pub. And that might be interesting because I think it would give us our location and it would kind of give us our location. Like we were told at one point that Magencia is at um, uh, latitude KJ and longitude LL. Now our map doesn't have those, but we could probably start to build out what those are. And maybe that's the point. And I, so I'm thinking if we get a sextant, then we can start mapping the places that we've been and we can start getting an idea of where things are. And maybe if we have any other, any other uh, notes, um, that could be helpful as well as far as if there's any other hidden islands and whatnot. It's entirely, entirely possible. But let's uh, look, ask around here. We need to find out about the dungeon and we need to find out about the stone. Now, I don't know if the dungeon is dungeon wrong. We've, that's the only dungeon we found and it is the closest. But um, so, so let's see, let's uh, start. Um, 
Can you tell me anything about the stone? I'm going to learn how to spell dungeon. <laughs> dungeon. No, okay. I didn't expect the guards to be able to be helpful with that, but I figured it was probably better to leave no stone unturned. Let's talk to the drunken fighter. What can you tell me of the stone? Oh, 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 here we go. Right off. Kabing. That was fast. So the stone of compassion is yellow. That dungeon despise. All right, that's good to know. Can you tell us anything about the altar that should be there? Despise. Okay. Oops. There we go. He turns away. He is drunken. Okay, so, so that's good. Let's let's just see if there's anybody else. This is her name, I think, was Pepper, because she's a spicy woman. If there's any other lore, maybe some maybe a a, a helpful thing to tell us where to get. Despise. I think I'm spelling that right. All right, so maybe we can. Get, we need a clue as far as, as far as um, where that might be. Let's see. So Julia's in leather, and Shamino's in leather. What do you have since I'm here? I want to buy chainmail. So it's more. It's well. It's probably more than five hundred bucks, or at five hundred bucks. Okay. I'm hoping that's not giving me a hint on a hit on my uh, honesty score. I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. Um, I think I need to be working on compassion. Yeah, I mean, I was I was doing okay. I'm at show it well, which I think is the four level. But uh, let's. Um, no, I don't want to get. Ugh. Uh, talk. Oh my gosh, I've lost all ability to play this game. I just want to give you some coins, good sir. Um, let's give him 20. All right, so let's just keep, whenever we find somebody that can, that can uh, accept a gift like that, let's do that. The Yellowstone is in Dungeons of Spies. Okay, so the Drunken Fighters all have the same thing. So you probably can't tell me anything about... I didn't ask you the guy about the yellow. Um, dungeon. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, despise. All right. Thank you. Are you, what are you? I am Joe. I think this is... Um, Yep, okay. I am Thievel. What can you tell me about the stone? Dungeon. Uh, altar. All right, you're not much of a help. How about you, Mr. Bard? Do you hear things? I am Cricket. Oh, we do need to buy some food. No, I just seen that. <laughs> um, tell me anything about the stone. A dungeon, altar, the spies. Okay, he's tired of my of my picky questions. So this guy, spirits, would it be? I'll take an ale. I'll pay. Th I'll pay three. Oh, what'd you like to know, friend? I can't help you there. Anything else? Yes. Uh, oh, so I, I get like one thing per. All right, let's 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 try that again. Food or ale? I'll do ale. Uh, let's pay three again. What would I like to know? So let's ask about, I think I did stone before. Dungeon. Can't help me with that. Oh, I think I was, instead of saying ye I don't know. Ale, three. Um, but, 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 just maybe despise. Hmm. I guess I should check. Also check my 
check my uh, notes here and see if we're supposed to ask for anything here in the town of Britain. All right, well, let's do this. Okay. Uh, ale. Three. Can you tell me anything about Mandrake? That subject is a bit foggy, perhaps. Perhaps more gold will refresh my memory. All right, well, let's give him five gold pieces. Oh, he wants even more. My, my, my. I'm going through all my money here. Wow. The last person that I knew that had any mandrake was the was an old alchemist named Calumny. Calumny. I know that name. I don't remember where we met Calumny, but we met Calumny. Uh, let's ask about Nightshade. Uh. Of Nightshade I know all but this. Seek out Virgil or thou shalt miss. Try intrinsic. Trinsic. Interesting. I ought to be I ought to be thoroughly south by now. Just for chuckles. Even though we were told to ask in Vesper or Yellow. Let's see if this guy knows anything about sextants. That subject, man, this guy, he is just, for, uh, let's see, for navigation, a sextant is vital. Ask for item D in the guild shops. Okay, I think that's good. Uh, I, what I'm thinking is, you know, so we've been told that to ask it specific, we were told to ask it Folly Tavern or Mandrake, and I didn't understand how to do that. Because I was asking all the people, I had to ask the barkeep, um, I'm guessing. And then we were told to ask in the pub at Yalom for the sextant. And then we were supposed to, in Vesper, we were supposed to ask about nightshade. But I'm guessing is all the barkeeps have probably got the same dialogue. So I think we've kind of done all three of those right here in Britain. The guild shops that he's talking about, uh, I, there's probably more than one, but we did see, we did run across one in Vesper. So I guess next time we're up that way in Vesper, I have a feeling if I go to Yehome and ask in the pub about the sextant, it's going to tell me the exact same thing, that there's a secret item D. I'm guessing when it brings up the menu, there's there's no item D shown. But if I ask for item D, uh, I can buy a sextant. Now, obviously, that's going to cost some some gold like this guy has. I mean, he's sucked down 100 of my gold. All right, so let's spend some more gold. We need to get some food, so let's do that. If I can get to the guy, there he is. Came to me, thank you. Yes, we need rations. Oh, wow, those are pricey, 40 gold pieces. Yikes, 25 for 40. Let's see, so t -t 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 if I bought, how many packs, if I bought four, four times four would be 160, and that would give me another 100. All right, that's fine. I think I did the math wrong. Four of 25, four times 40 would be 80 gold pieces. Okay, I guess I did that right. Nope, I'm good. Yeah, because I got a hundred, I, I guess I did that right. All right, so we aren't, we don't have a ton of, we don't have a ton of gold now. I don't know that we need a ton of gold. I am Joe, we talked to you. I think we've gotten what we're gonna get from here. Um, I don't think there's anybody else left to talk to. I think that's where I, where I actually found the rune of compassion now that I now that I think about it. All right, let's talk to this bozo here. Why shepherd? Can you tell me anything about the stone dungeon? Can't help me with that. Altar. Can't help me with that. Despise. Cannot help me with that. Okay. So basically you're no help. All right, that's good. I think we, we got what we wanted. We we now know we now know uh, what the stone is, what the color is, and what the dungeon is that uh, goes along with um, uh, compassion. All right, so let's see if we can make our way to Magentia here. 
So first of all, we need to go find the moon gate. Let's get out of town. Let's ignore it. This guy gonna follow me the whole way? Come on, get out. I think the moon gates. Yeah, it should be like right around here. Okay, so we are at Lord British and that is the Crescent Waxing, which has got the um, Crescent on the left side. And we wanna go to Magencia. That's with the Crescents on the other side. So if it looks like a pair of parentheses, <laughs> that's when I wanna go. Okay, I took a kind of a roundabout path, but uh, I ended up here in Yelom. Uh, we can get to Magencia from, from Yelom, but we also have some things we need to do here. I, I don't think that, uh, let's see, the Yelom is Valor. We are showing that we're showing Valor. We improved from last time with Hawkwind, so maybe we'll give Jenna another try. But at a minimum, we need to get uh the rune we do not have the rune we have we know where the shrine is we know where the location of the stone is what we do not have is the rune so we need to find that but let's start off by visiting our dear friend oh no no yalom that's with the guy that's not jenna i'm thinking a different i'm thinking of um you i think but here we had the guy that was behind the closed door right right yes let's jimmy this lock now that we can finally do this and let's talk to this guy somebody new a five a six foot five great warrior wow he's tall what is your name i am joffrey what is your job? I lead into battle. I desire to fight again in battle. All right. Yes, we've got our we got our, our next companion. Okay, so let's take a look at his stats and see what there is. Okay, so he is a fighter. He has no magic ability whatsoever. He's got pretty high strength and dexterity. Intelligence, eh, not so much. He has an axe. Hmm. Hmm. I'm tempted to maybe switch the uh, weapons between him and Julia. Um, because she's got a mace, but axe is, is supposed to be what's better for her. Because uh, she is a tinker. And I'm thinking maybe a mace would be a better would be a better um, weapon for the fighter. Yeah, we may do that. We may do that. Okay, that's excellent news. I'm also very happy that, uh, you know, I was correct. While we're in here, just for chucks, I'd hate to find out that I dimmy the lock and the rune is in here. Oh, no, we, we have the rune, don't we? We have the rune. Where am I at? I'm in Yalom. We don't have the rune. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate to hear that, you know, that the rune is here and, oh, it's in the locked room. And I got to jimmy it again, but nothing, nothing found. Okay, very good news. We have our fifth. We have our fifth one. So let's see if I don't, a housekeeper max. What can you tell me about the rune? Nothing. Good day, sir. All right, let's talk to this guy here. Far away look. Know ye anything of the rune? He knows nothing. Okay, well then, you are no help. Let's talk to the shepherd. Five foot, they're really specific on their heights. 
<laughs> here in uh, here in Yalom. I, I I don't really understand why that would be. It's the town of valor, not of of exact measurements, but you know whatever. <laughs> No ye, no, dear five foot pregnant woman. No ye anything to ruin. You do not. All right. Let's go talk to this guy in the pub. Gravnor. Okay. No ye anything of the ruin. Cannot help you with that. By the way, I, I should check, double check. Do we know of the stone? We know of the stone of valor. Okay, good. Wanted to make sure. Wanted to make sure. All right. He yeah, me with the rune. Ale, I'll pay three. What did you like to know, friend? Anything about the rune? Can't help me there. I'll buy another ale. I'll pay three. I should pay him two one of these times and see if that will be enough. If I do, if I really need to grease his palm again. Let's ask about, what was one of the things that I asked about? Let's ask about the sexton again. I'm curious if I'm going to get the same bit of information. Yeah, so I got to give him... What if I gave him 25? Oh, it's got to be 30, apparently. Yeah, okay, same same thing. So I think they may have different names, but I think they all have the same, same stuff there. So I'm not going to worry about that. All right, we really need to go kill some things because we need more money. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, all my heavy drinking... You're no help. All right. What about you? Good, sir. Who's running away from me? Stop running. I am X. Stone. I think we know this already. The red stone. Red is for valor, a virtue of the avatar. Art thou an avatar? Um, I'm going to say no. Then thou shalt need the red stone in one Altar room to get the third part of the key. I think we knew that. I think I got that already. Yes, I, I, I had made that note. All right, good. Um, can you tell me anything about the key? Altar. I don't know if I asked these questions. Red is for valor, a virtue of the avatar. Okay, that's the same thing we just did. Uh, I'm saying no because I haven't gotten all eight perfected. Okay. Do you know anything about the rune? Probably not, because usually if they have, you know, if they have knowledge about one thing, then they don't have knowledge of other things. <sighs> Rune. All right. All right. Uh, talk to this guy. Might be the same people, guy that I was talking to down below. Healing, healing, healing. Well, we do not need healing, but I am not. Yes. Nope. Yes. All right. So I'm, I'm hoping I'm, uh, if I do that like twice every time I see those guys, then I'm hoping that that will um, get my compassion score. Okay, we talked to him turned up pretty quickly. I'm, I'm trying to, to, to fast fast track that. That's the term I want trying to use. This I am slithe. Okay, we've not had to slithe this time. Okay, you can't help me with the rune. You're you're of no help. Somebody's gotta know about the rune. Small man. To be brave Yes, that's my problem. Okay. The rune's got to be... There's got to be... Somebody's got to know something about the rune. So who's it going to be? Am I missing... If Am I missing... Did I talk to both of these guys? I talked to Sir William... That's Sir William again. Wish you guys would like dress differently. Mighty warrior. I think I talked to this guy. All right. Healing. Mm 
We've been to the inn. We've been to the pub. I don't think there's anybody else in any of the rooms of the inn. Oh, there's somebody in here. I wonder how many magic keys I have left. I'll have to look. Lord Robert. Wasn't there a Lord Robert we met in one of the other things? What's your job? I battle for Lord British. Okay. Um, am I valiant? What did Hawkwind say I was? I am showing valiant valor. So I think I can say with all honesty that yes, I am a valiant warrior. Thou dost deserve the rune, ask Nostro. Who the bloody heck is Nostro? <laughs> ah. There's always somebody new to ask. Where would Nostro be? Ask Nostro. Is that somebody here? I don't recognize that name. Wouldn't be this person. That was Max. The bloody hell was Nostro. That's X. That's Luke. Lady Donna. Sir Hrothgar. Sir William. No response from that person. No response from that person. All right. Health is poor. Okay. I mean, presumably, he, whoever this Nostro is, should be here. Slife, yeah, okay. We talked to that person. This person was Aesop. Yeah, Aesop. So, uh, where the bloody hell could Nostro be? Oh, up, up, up. oh, yeah, I do want to exchange now, now that I think about it. So, a uh, new order. I want to exchange. Okay, so let's first exchange three and five. And then let's exchange four and five. So we'll have our two fighters be first, Julia, and then Iolo. I think that works. I think that works. Okay. So, you did not have a name, right? Yeah, he won't even talk to me. All right. Let's just, let's just double check with all these guards, because some of them will talk and some of them won't. He turns away. They're not much for conversation, these guys. His name is Guard, okay. He turns away. All right, you guys are just, you're not much fun to talk to. I'm a guard. Okay, so maybe up, like up here someplace? I'm looking for secret passages. I'm not seeing any. I'm not seeing any people. I'm still very, very intrigued by these force fields here. Timrod. Well, Timrod, where is Nostro? Should I ask at the pub, maybe? I suppose it can't hurt. Maybe they've heard of Nostro. 
see food. I mean, look at look at um, look at our food. We're down to seventy eight just from running around here. Uh, 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 East place costs twenty. I don't know. Let's buy thirty plates. Oh man, we're so far down on. Yes, ale two. You don't get any information if you just pay them two. Oh, that sucks. Nostro. All right. This person has got to be Grafnor. You guys move around too much. X. Slife. A ranger with a faraway look. Luke. I guess I could try the innkeep and just make sure. Smirk. Okay. I, I don't expect any of the shopkeepers. Valiant. Willard are going to be Nostro, but I've, I've talked to everybody else, and this is going to be fun. Triplet. Apparently, I've given enough for now, which is just fine, because I... Still triplet. Okay, so prob they're probably all triplet. <sighs> you know, there's three of them, triplet. You know, I can, I can read that writing on the wall. I guess maybe this is why we didn't find out anything... about the room when we were here last time. What was this guy's name again? Smirk, that's right. And he was somebody else. X. Oh, get out of my way, X. X, you're killing me. I want that guy back in the corner. X. X. Grave fighter, what's your name? Yeah, Gravnor, duh. Slife. Pregnant woman, name. Lady Donna. Luke. I mean, I've talked to all these people like four times now, I think. And this is the only kind of little hidden section you can get to, and that's only got Aesop in it. Let me make sure there's not a hidden anything along here. I am not seeing anything. There's only one way in and out of town. I can't go beyond that. What's back in here? A lot of nothing. No hidden. Once again, no hidden anything. Right, right, right. Yep. I'm being, I'm being careful. I'm trying to be methodical here. All right, this is annoying me. Um, this is annoying me. So this was Lord Robert. Mysterious warrior. Fight for Lord Britain. Yeah, uh, yes. Nostro. Maybe it's not here. I mean, the rune of spirituality was not was not there. So I guess we're just going to have to keep an eyeball open for somebody named Nostro in the future. Because that person does not exist in this town. That is clear to see. Excuse me, sir. Good day. All right, so let's make our way to Magencia. So Magencia is crescent waning. So that's... On the right, we are in uh, Yellow Mets first quarter. So that's what I need right there. Ugh. I'm in Moonglow. I came to Moonglow instead of because I'm an idiot. Not that we didn't know that, but let's see if we can get back and get and get to Magencia. I'm more interested in getting the stuff there. And we might have the 
ability to get a twofer on the um, companions because I think there's a companion for us on Magentia, and we have, and we actually have, uh, we are ready for um, elevation there. So let's see. So Moon Glow is full, is New Moon, and we want uh, for Yale, and we want uh, first quarter. That's not where I wanted to be. Okay, so here we are in back at uh, Moonglow. Um, I've spent quite a bit of time trying to uh, make my way to Magentia, and I, I just I haven't been riding the Moon Gates right. So I think what we'll do here is we'll we'll finish up the episode. We need a couple things here, so this isn't totally a, a waste of time. We already know that we can't get the companion here that's fine but what we don't have is the we know of the stone but we don't know where the shrine is and we don't have the rune this is the town of honesty so we need to find those things all right so this is gonna be the welcome guy right greetings yep 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 uh nope i do not Perhaps a shrine which lives which lies on an aisle to the north. Okay, that is helpful. Okay, well, there are a couple of aisles north of that. We'll have to look at you know. Obviously, we we need a boat. We need a boat uh, to get to this. We got a couple items as we need to hit. Um, okay, so that's that's fifty percent of what we need to do here. We need to get, find the shrine, and we have, or at least we know its location. So that's good. All right, so we need to go and find somebody that can tell us about the rune. You can't help me with the rune. I know we've talked to all these people before, so I'm not necessarily going to bother with all their their dialogue because we've we've gone through this, and I don't. I don't see any real need to um, to go through all that again. Okay, let's open this. Here we are in the Christian rune. Can it help me with that? This guy's got a lot of gold, man. Starving's your job. I'm a writer. Can't help me with that. All right. I'm trying to figure out why she's starving when she's got all these boxes of gold around here. I'm just... All right. Is there anybody in this other room? Nope, and it's not leading to a secret area either. Did I touch the child? Okay, you can't help me with that, playful child. You are worthless. All right, I think I asked both of these guys already. Is there somebody hiding in the verge here? Humble Shepherd. You know, I probably should at least be asking the names in case we run across Nostro. Gosh darn it. The humble shepherd. I am shepherd. I thought we were in the land of honesty. We are in the land of honesty. I am shepherd. Okay. Humility is not derived from the direct combination 
of truth, love, or courage. That's strange. All right. Somebody here has got to kn at least know the rune. You can't help me with the rune. Healer. Shazam. Rune. What is your name? Watch this be Nostro. No, you ain't the rune. I can't give you gold. Oh, uh, boy. Let's give him 10. Okay. Out of the, out of the little that I have, I've given you 10. All right. So there's somebody down there. It's not looking too likely. Let's go to the end. I'm gonna come up here and I'm gonna find the shepherd person again. And then this person was the person I already talked to. Yep. Who haven't I talked to? There's up here. I don't know if that's her chest. I, I every time I come, she's got a chest. Um Name, Mariah, job, adventure. This would have been, I think, my... Um, yeah, she can't join me. Uh, but does she know anything about the rune? No. She would have been my companion if I wasn't a mage. So, that's, that's that story. Why can I not find this? I sh there should be at least a clue. Yeah, I mean, because these, these shopkeepers... It's down here. Magical herb. Well, of course there's magical herbs. Name. Browning. Do you know anything about the rune? You do not. How about you, good sir? Name. Rune. All right, neither one of you can help me with the rune. I don't need magical stuff, which is a really good thing because. Okay. And I've been to the healer. What else is there? Sage Deli. I haven't talked to this kid. William. Search for the Rune of Honesty by Mariah's Gold. By Mariah's Gold. Okay, that's our... That's that's the, the, the woman who would have been our companion. Okay, now we have it. The Rune of Honesty. Excellent. We got it. We got it. Yay for us. Yay for us. So now we have everything that we need um, to, once we get to the point where we have elevated, to go and um, pray at the Shrine of Honesty. Um, or Yeah, Honesty. That's where we're at. We're at Honesty, right? Yes. Okay. Unfortunately, right now, we are a thief and a scoundrel. We are the lowest of the low when it comes to honesty. So it's going to be a while before we can use this, but at least we've got that done. We've got those things taken care of. But I am going to let that be that. Uh, I will be back uh, soon with another episode, and I do hope you will join me then. So until then, be seeing you.